Grant Report. Brought to you by iFurniture. Better, cheaper, smarter. Visit iFurniture.ca. Now, Grant Johnson. I love that there's a doctor out there called Dr. Killjoy. It's his nickname. Dr. Andrew Kelso is his actual, actual name, but... He's known as Dr. Killjoy or Dr. No Fun because he's always speaking out, telling people to cut down on drinking and cut down on sugar and all that fun stuff. The latest one, uh, he's put out a warning telling people not to eat all their Easter candy this weekend in one session. He says it's terrible for you. It's terrible for your teeth and your sugars and everything else. Why do we have chocolate for Easter? (laughs) Does anybody know? I know the Easter bunny leaves it. But has anybody thought, why is the Easter Bunny breaking into my home and leaving chocolate all over the place? Was it just a way to get people more hyped up about Easter? Like, were there people in a boardroom like, hey, yeah, nobody really, kids don't care about Easter. We need to do something to get them hooked. And they're like, chocolate, give them chocolate, lots of it. My kids get so stoked for Easter. They've been counting down to Easter. I don't think they would if there was no chocolate. Would they be stoked to get up? Easter Sunday, if there was no giant Easter bunnies, you know, Santa gives you presents, Tooth Fairy gives you money, Easter Bunny gives you chocolate. Cupid really needs to step his game up. 